What's going on guys? So in this one, I'm gonna be showing you the nine biggest niches of Q4. If you're a beginner watching this video and you're looking for a niche to get started in, then I highly suggest considering one of these niches. The reason being is because all of these niches spike massively in popularity for Q4. It's where people are spending more and more money and it's where products in these niches are becoming more and more in demand. So for your best chances to capitalize on this time of year and start seeing results as quickly as possible, then definitely give one of these niches a try. I will be showing you the data behind these niches as well, of course. These aren't just random niches I've plucked out of thin air. These are all data-backed selected niches, so I will be showing you that information as well. Thanks for tuning in, and let's jump straight into niche number one. So niche number one is gonna be the toy niche. I know it's the cliche one, it's the biggest one of Q4. You've probably seen it before, but it has to be mentioned in this video. I promise later on in the video, there will be some niches you've never even thought about or considered before, so make sure you stay tuned for that but purely because of the size of this niche and fact that Christmas is for children it's when grandparents go crazy it's when parents go crazy buying toys for their children it has to get a mention in this video like I said though all of my selections are backed by data so let's take a look at the Google Trends information for this niche at the top here we have toys as a search term UK 2004 to present and if I just bring my cursor along we can see September starts to creep up October November hitting a peak in December and this repeats year on year. If we go to the time in which we're in now in October we're at a 40 score so as we can see it's just about to start increasing well it has started increasing and this is only going to go up and up and up until we reach that December month. Also in the toy niche itself there is dozens and dozens of great products. It's just about finding the select one that has that little unique factor that's gonna grab attention on social media and exploit that with a great creative. Put it in front of grandparents on Facebook and you're gonna be onto a winner. Niche number two is gonna be the dog niche, dog toys specifically. Now I know it's another stereotypical niche but please do stick with me in this video. Again, it's such a massive niche that it has to get a mention in this video. This time of year, people go crazy for anything dog related dogs are such a massive part of people's family people see dogs as like their children and people buy your dog gifts so as somebody who's had a dog for the last four years every single Christmas my mum will buy him a gift my dad will buy him a gift all my brothers and sisters will buy him gifts so people go crazy for dog toys and because there's 10 to 15 million people in the UK who own dogs most people know somebody who has a dog and therefore when you run your ads the chances are you're going to come across some Somebody who needs to buy a dog present for somebody making dog toys specifically a great niche this is also backed by the data so if we take a look at Google Trends we can see there's clear spikes at certain times in the year usually around November time that year December it hit a peak in 2014 November December in 2015 November December 2016 and this year is going to be no different and as we can see we're at the very beginning of that increase and uprise making this a great niche to get involved in today right now this month niche number two is going to be the LED niche so this is anything to do with lighting basically because especially here in the UK when it gets dark when the clocks go back and it's dark by four or five o'clock then lights become a bigger factor in people's lives they want to light their houses up they need to light up themselves when they're commuting whether they're walking whether they're cycling whether they're walking their dog and there's so many different led products that you can drop ship which are going to fix those pain points and fix those problems people have let's take a look at the search term on google trends and again we can clearly see there is a spike in popularity for led products um, sort of at September time. Well, pretty much a month already into the spike here in the UK. So if you were gonna consider LED lights and definitely once you've finished watching this video, start building your store out, get to action, start looking for some products to sell. The next niche I wanna speak about only quickly because it's similar to one I've already mentioned is cat toys. So again, a lot of people have cats out there in the millions in the UK. So most people know somebody who has a cat and therefore will most likely be looking for a cat toy or cat accessory or cat treats to buy that person to give to their cat. People are also super passionate about cats, about their dogs. They love to post pictures, making it a great niche to 
go into throughout the whole year and actually build a brand around because the demand for cat and dog products is always going to be consistently high throughout the year. The reason I wanted to include it in this video is because recently I've actually discovered two if not three really great proven winning products and I've featured them in some past videos so make sure you go and check those ones out. If we take a quick look at the info on Google Trends we can see again there's a clear spike in popularity in Q4 and again we're sort of maybe a month maybe even two months into the kind of peak popularity of cat toys so this is one that you need to act on fast as well the next one i want to speak about is baby gifts baby gifts is a great niche throughout the entire year because when somebody has a child everybody wants to spoil that child immediately grandparents parents themselves they want to buy cute outfits get it different toys educational things to help it develop and christmas is like a catalyst to that it's like throwing petrol fuel on the fire people have an excuse now to spoil their grandchildren or spoil their children so it's just a great excuse to spend even more money or even more people are looking to buy baby gifts for their grandchildren or for their actual children. A side note on this niche, another reason why I like it so much is because it fits the perfect customer, that fits the bill for Facebook advertising, which is my specialism. It has been since 2016. By far, at least in my experience, I should say that the biggest buyers or the biggest traction or the best buyers um, for me in those years has always been females over the age of 50 which fit that ideal customer target um, for baby gifts tags in those newly became grandparents if that's the right way of wording it they want to spoil their grandchildren so if you can put something new and exciting in front of them they're going to buy it we can also check out the google trends information on this and as we can see there's a fairly strong demand all year round as i've already mentioned but as we come into q4 and get closer to christmas that demand increases and here in the uk we're not quite there at that point but we can still see it's quite strong but it's definitely going to go up in the next few weeks the next niche i want to speak about is jewelry jewelry is such a broad niche it's kind of like a mega niche i'd definitely be a bit more specific than just go out there and sell like generic watches definitely try and find some jewelry which is targeted towards a dog owner or targeted towards a girlfriend or a boyfriend or partner whatever it may be obviously christmas is a time to buy things for your loved ones and people you care about and this is where jewelry comes in because there's a lot of jewelry out there readily available to start drop shipping immediately and it's one of the most popular things that a partner will buy their partner um, during this time of year this again is also backed up by the google trends information we can see there's a fairly strong demand for jewelry a, a very good demand in fact i should say for jewelry all throughout the year but again there's some clear as day spikes in popularity and year on year this happens in q4 as we can see we've not quite hit that spike in popularity yet makes it a great niche you've probably got a couple of weeks to find some great products put a store together to put yourself in a position ready to capitalize on these time of year another niche which has to be mentioned this time of year is decorations or more specifically christmas decorations i shouldn't have to show you the google trend information obviously for this one but what the hell let's take a look there's pretty much zero demand all throughout the year until we get to sort of middle of October time we can see we're just about to hit that increase in popularity with it hitting its peak in sort of November December time there's some great options on AliExpress I've also got some great options which I'm going to show you in tomorrow's video which is going to be some hand selected products by myself data backed selected products that you can get started with right away so make sure you subscribe not to miss that one a word of warning though when it comes to Christmas decorations make sure you go with a reputable supplier that's going to be supplying if you're selling lights that is you're selling lights that come with the required safety certifications and tests so you know that you're selling a safe product if you can sell a product which isn't electrically powered then that's always going to be favorable to finish the video off then probably with two specific niches that you've never even considered or thought about um, the first one i'm going to mention is charging docks so charging docks when it comes to gifts are super super popular i'll show you the google trend information in a second it's the perfect thing that you get somebody that you're not quite sure what to get there's really only two main sort of uh, 
uh, iPhones. There's only really sort of two main phone brands out there and you can get charging docks which encompass all of that plus Apple Watches plus headphones, that sort of thing. They make a great gift. I have featured stores in the past that have made significant amounts of money selling charging dock stations. If you're not sure what a charging dock station is, then basically it's a neat way, rather than having a cable for your phone, a cable for your watch, a cable for your headphones, a cable for um, your alarm clock, it's a way of kind of combining all of that into one in one neat and tidy package. This, as we can see, is also backed up by the Google Trend information. There's a fairly strong-ish demand for charging docks, but again, there's a clear kind of time of year where demand for this spikes in popularity. And I don't believe this is gonna be people buying charging docks for themselves, especially because the spike is in sort of October, November, December time. It's gonna be people who don't know what to get somebody, so they get them a kind of cheap-ish product in and around sort of 30 pounds, so that they can kind of tick them off the list and show them they haven't been forgotten about, basically. So definitely a great time of year to get into this sort of thing and accommodate that market and supply that market. Could even be your marketing angle of targeting those people who don't necessarily know what to get people. So you could even open up your creative with not sure what to get so-and-so. Best-selling charging dock of 2022 is a great option. And the final niche I wanna show you guys is the diffuser niche. Now, this is such a great niche in my opinion because when it comes to Christmas, people like nice smells. They like to feel warm and cozy. Um, in the video I'm gonna put out tomorrow or Monday, there's a diffuser on there that's new for 2022. It has such a cool effect to it. If there was one product, that I was going to back myself, it would probably would be this diffuser. If I show you the Google Trend information, we can see that diffuser in the UK is used to be pretty much non-existent, um, but there's a clear kind of spike in popularity, December time, November, December time, December time, uh, December time that year, and we can see it's just about to start increasing in popularity now, which makes it a great time to get involved. Make sure you subscribe so you see the next couple of videos I'm putting out. Um, I'm putting out a video every single day. This diffuser I'm gonna show you is awesome, um, has a really cool effect. It's gonna get a lot of attention on social media and definitely a great product to consider. So make sure you subscribe not to miss that one. And so with that being said then guys, that is the niches I wanted to share with you in this video. I really hope I've given you some ideas and some inspiration to get started on your business and truly make you for the time of year that changes everything for you. It sounds really cheesy, but um, I've been through that time myself back in 2016. I've made a fair bit of money and it was able to kind of set myself up and, and do this full time ever since. So it is truly a great opportunity. Don't let it go past you. Don't put it off until next year. Get to work, build on your business, find some great products in some of these niches I've shared you with, get testing them online um, on different platforms and you truly never know what can happen. Thanks for watching, all the best. I'll see See you in the next one.